was class. What else would you expect in Italy, the land, the home of opera? What a wonderful save. Fantastic stop by Oblak. Instinctive from the Atletico goalkeeper, but he kept it out. Well, it was an incredible... Shot deflected by Savic, the Montenegrin. They'll get the corner. Uh, certainly worth an effort by the German there. That they're ready to make his move on by Bale and bundled over the line. Sergio Ramos, who scored Rails late, late equaliser in Lisbon, has put them in front in Milan. It's taken less than 15 minutes. what it means to those supporters in white. A uh, tremendous movement from the free kick. There was trouble from the first free kick when Bale took it. And uh, Casimiro... Whipped in by Koke. Nasty ball. Could have caused problems. It was goaded. Had to go for goal in the end. Nice ball by Koke forward. Griezmann, offside, wouldn't have counted anyway. What an interesting and difficult skill to produce there, Griezmann, letting it run across his body and hitting it on the volley with his left foot. Quite clearly offside, a good decision by the English assistant on the far side. Here's Griezmann. Well, the Frenchman wants to shoot at every opportunity and was worth an effort in Lisbon two years ago, but it's Raul who've made the breakthrough in the first half in Milan in the San Siro. Sergio Ramos with the goal after Raul had gone. I mean, I, I sometimes don't get that. If, it's, if you think there's something wrong at half-time, change it. But so many coaches these days are, are programmed almost to say, wait for five minutes, ten time, minutes, fifteen minutes. Cocky prefer to be in the middle. Cocky prefer to be in the middle. Yeah, I think he's, uh, he likes to be... You want your play, best yeah. players in the yeah. middle where you get more of the ball. Yeah, exactly. And he likes to move over there. He's got more chances to go forward because Gabi... Looking for Fernando Torres. It's a penalty. Debatable decision. And I thought Torres was looking for it a little bit. Tattenberg had no... Uh... It's Griezmann. And he's thundered in against the underside with a crossbar. A missed opportunity for Atletico. What a chance for Diego Simeone's team to get back in the game. Well, they've got great spirit. They shouldn't be deterred. They won't be deterred. They had a shade more possession than Real in the first half, even though Real took the lead. And Godin is the target, and he managed to get there. And Savage has just jabbed that wide. Good leap. Bale. New York aggregate win last season, but domestically certainly. Atletico have had the upper hand. They've won their last eight fixtures against their city rivals when they've played in Spain. Not a bad effort by Bale, uh, skimming that ball across this beautiful... Rasco against Swift to get onto his feet. Met by Saul. He wants more, both from his team and the Atletico supporters. Well, they're pushing hard. It was a, it was a great ball in, and it was a terrific. There's a chance now for Al, a chance to seal it. Decent save by Oblak, but there were alternatives available then to Karim Benson. Torres up. Ronaldo! Took the shot early. Juan Fran! The level! Right on cue! Carrasco's goal! There's the irony! 12 minutes to go! And it's all on! And they deserve it! 
And an erring finish from Yannick Carrasco, set up by Juan Fran. The grunt faces on those supporters. Provided the cross which presented Atletico with a chance to get that first goal. He's given Juan Fran the slip. And Gordy might have just got in there ahead of his goalkeeper, but important now that Atletico keep their concentration inside the last five minutes. Does superbly well, doesn't he, Godin? The 30 year old Uruguayan. What a pillar of strength he's been for this Atletico side over the last few seasons. How did it go to penalties? If what it goes it, to penalties, you, you think? Antoine Griezmann. I was just about to say that. <laughs> <laughs> you got there before I did. <laughs> You were saying, uh, watching it, Alan, he'd have been thinking about that last night. Oh, no doubt. Because of the one that was saved. Yeah. It would have been awkward for our black. Looking for Bale. And it came away off Ronaldo's knee and straight into the grateful arms of our black. Very grateful arms. Got lucky there, did our black. Hesitation. Tripping run by Carrasco and eventually was crowded out. Well, they've got a great recruitment policy at Atletico, and certainly the and Monaco forward is. Uh... Listen, we've got another 15 minutes. They're, they're, they're in, or they're on autopilot now. All these players. You know, yeah, it's like no risk football, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, you try and win it, but you win it without risk. Even if your players are thinking. Casemiro. A little bit hit and hope, but worth taking a chance. Yeah, it's worth a drive. Modric uh, sets him up. Nice little touch there by Modric, just inside to give him the space. But uh... the instructions being passed on to Thomas Party, the Ghanaian who is set to come on as Vasquez, who scores. Lucas Vasquez puts Real Madrid in front calmly slid into the corner side of the foot it's Griezmann he makes sure this time 1-1 well some compensation for him who also scores 2-1 three penalties taken three scored uh, beautifully it's Gabby, unerring, 2-2, it was a magnificent penalty. Fail, cool as you like. 3-2, pressure is on, Atletico again. Doesn't make any difference, it's 3-3. A perfect set of penalties. Nerves of steel. Beautifully struck. Ramos set. Ramos scores. Making it very difficult for the goalkeeper with the slight head. It's hit the post and come out. Champions League for the third time in a European Cup final there is disappointment for Atletico La Decima for Real two years ago now they have their 11th Champions Cup a fantastic spectacle Nail gripping to the very end. A wonderful occasion, a dramatic occasion, and won by Cristiano Ronaldo. The Portuguese who has made the Champions League his own with Lionel Messi of Barcelona in recent years. He was looking to score in three Champions League finals. He would have been the first to do that. But he has scored in the penalty shootout and he has got the decisive goal in that shootout. Cheers for Atletico.
a consoling arm around the shoulder of Juan Fran, whose penalty attempt came back off the post. Juan Fran, the only player to miss in that dramatic shootout. But it is Cristiano Ronaldo has delivered yet again for Real. It had to be him. That's why he takes the fifth penalty. Because Cristiano Ronaldo doesn't miss. And of course, he can rightly claim mine was the decisive kick. It was a masterclass in penalty taking up until Juan Fran hit the post. And his eyes will have lit up. Cristiano Ronaldo. A half naked Cristiano Ronaldo. Has only gone and done it again. And you've got to feel for Atletico. You really have. But we were talking about courage, we were talking about stepping forward.